so for reference, I was planning on posting this on Homestuck Day last year. This is being filmed on the 22nd ish of April 2022. So, how's lockdown going? I'm assuming we're still in it. So nope. I'm Boris is still somehow running the country. Nope. Sorry about those midterm, presumably. Nope. Yeah, yeah, see me icon. First things first, though, right? I just want to point out one of the sellers I got parts from for this was called Cal's Bricks. Motherfucking miracles. to show this down last year. Not all the parts arrived in time, so here he is now. And what a him he is. So, yeah. For anyone unfamiliar with Homestuck, leave now while you still can. For anyone that is similarly cursed with knowledge, you already recognise Coltier Gamzee, a rascally clown and potion seller. Now, technically, these aren't entirely accurate potions as... Well, this one's purple, and his his blood is purple. Not that these are blood. Who told you that these are potions? Anyway. Uh, yeah, the other one is green, which I'm not sure is actually a troll blood colour. Oh, well. And, yeah, I got, like, as many D-shards as I could. There's the bad, there's a bad quest card piece. There's the uh, stupid little shoes and the capes. And the ridiculous pointy hat. The eyes aren't perfect, but they're as close as I can get them. I feel like the uh, hood shaping, the hood shaping on this guy did come out pretty well though, and the collar. Ideally, these these would come down and be pointy, but like my options were basically three of them, and the rest arrayed in pretty much the right spots, or four hanging down the front and none elsewhere. And this way just makes more sense to me, so that's what I went with. Um, yeah, not a whole to say about this guy. This is my first time really building in the uh, Brickhead style, and it's honestly, I'm not really into the Brickhead line and aesthetic, but this is, it's fun to build in, you know? It's it's neat. I kind of wish to do more Universal Studios monsters, because I have Frankenstein upstairs, and like, he's getting pretty lonely. Like, oh, where is my boy Dracula? He's in the cultural zeitgeist now, what with everyone having received letters from their friend Jonathan. Anyway. Yeah, not really a whole lot to say about this guy. I captured the uh, subject later face paint as best I could. But, you know, it's not a pro it's brickheads. It has to be kind of an approxim a kind of squared off approximation, so he ends up with... Uh, it looks more like a smiley face than was entirely intentional. You got the hair poking out of the hood. 
and that's honest that's like honestly about it. There's not a whole lot else to really say about this guy. You now if I could have made this top piece more curved, I would have done. But it's as close as I'm gonna get. You know, given that uh, I'm working mostly with angles here. And if anyone has suggestions for a better way of doing the, the stupid pointy hat, by all means, you know, have at me. And I'll close by saying that one of my online friends once described this guy as greasy by choice. She was fucking right to do so. Right, see you guys next time. If you don't know anything about Homestuck and you stuck around for this, good god, why? <laughs>